After weeks of negotiating, Parkview and United Healthcare have reached a multi year agreement. But for some customers, this decision comes too late. News Channel 15's Aaron Rodgers joins us now with more on the agreement and the people affected by it. Mark and Heather, we heard from a lot of people through our social media outlets. Many were relieved. Others say they've already switched and they aren't switching back. Now, you may remember earlier this month, Parkview said it was cutting ties with United because it wasn't a part of the insurance company's Medicare expansion plan. And people with UHC would have until April to switch doctors or switch insurance. But after an agreement reached this week, now anyone with UHC insurance will have in network coverage at Parkview hospitals, doctor's office, and walk in clinics. Both Parkview and UHC, UHC say they'll work toward a cost-effective Medicare Advantage plan for 2016 and that they were sorry for any inconveniences they caused. Patients like Bruce Driver, whom we talked to when the news came out about the separation, says he's glad an agreement was reached, but it came at a cost to him and other patients. I hope that it will put some people at ease because of being uh, seniors. The older you get, the less change you accept in your life. And I, I'm sure to probably put a lot of people in a panic mode. So I hope that they can avoid these kind of situations in the future. Driver says he's already switched doctors because he recently had a knee surgery and didn't want any problems. He says he doesn't plan on switching back, but he did get a call from the CEO of Parkview personally apologizing. Aaron Rodgers, News Channel 15.